The next point that we're going to show you in our little uh, group of go-to points from Kyushu Jitsu is a point right under the cheekbones called small intestine 18. If you're in close with a grappling situation or they're trying to take you down or an unwanted embrace or whatever, you can slip a knuckle or a hard surface in and use that pushing to get the person off of you. All right? And just leaning into this point. Now you can use both sides. I'm not going to use the other side of Dallas because he's got a bad tooth there. But you can also use this as a strike point using one knuckle and tapping into it just like that and to dizzy the person up and get them off of you. If you can come in again with another striking method, it's this palm, just like this, with a little twist. And he's got his arms on you, you just pop him right there with a little bit of a twist, and you can see the legs start to kick out on you. But the little twist is the key to that. One of the reasons that I like this point so much is because you can look at people and, and determine where they're weak or where their nerves are a little bit stretched underneath the skin. Being as a pressure point is an anatomical marker that marks out the underlying nervous nerve structure. If you see a person that has higher cheekbones, you can palm or hit up under there like this. But my favorite way is to just palm up here like this with a twist. And you can knock the arms down if they grab at you or whatever, and then just palm like this. If it's in a fast-moving, dynamic situation, if you miss this point, you're still going to hit into the eye or the jaw. Okay, but if they're standing still and boom, popping just like that, and give it a little twist, you're going to get a slight dysfunction. As soon as you get that slight dysfunction, you can either escape or attack his mobility by attacking his legs. One of the reasons that I like small intestine 18 in our little series of go-to points here is because it is a, a more susceptible to what I call a shotgun approach. In a fast-moving dynamic self-defense situation, you can get a, lot, a quick number of strikes in there. And as long as you cut your angles up, you're going to get a dysfunction of some type with this. If you miss, you're going to come into the eye or the jaw, which will still give you some type of an effect. But if you aim small, miss small, you're going to get a greater effect by coming into small intestine 18. If they have large cheekbones, they're going to be more vulnerable for this point. And our little set of go-to points in Kyushu Jitsu, if you would like to learn more, I teach at the Jefferson Sportsman's Mall in Washington, Indiana. I have seminars worldwide. Just check out my Facebook page, Jim Corns Kyushu Jitsu. And I also teach for a large organization in Germany called Okudin Circle. Thank you.